I like to share with you some of the plugins that I like to use for my Hyper Terminal. So on hyper.is, let's click on plugins and we'll be able to see the featured plugins. One plugin that I like to use is Hyper Search. So let's hit install on the bottom and copy the command, go back to our Hyper Terminal and paste the command in. Now it says Hyper Search install successfully. So one way to double check that it has been enabled and installed is by going to the configuration file for your Hyper Terminal. To do that, let's hit on Hyper Preferences, and this is our configuration file for our terminal. And on the very bottom, we'll be able to see all the installed plugins, and Hyper Search is one of them. Great. Let's go back to the plugin page, and on the bottom, let's hit View Source Code. Now we see the Hyper Search plugin repository without being redirected to GitHub, which is pretty cool. Let's go to README to find out how to use the search controls. So on the top, it says type command F to toggle the search controls. So let's go back to our hyper terminal and hit command F on Mac. So I don't see anything popping up. And the reason is because we probably need to restart our hyper terminal. So let's do that. So restart, open a new one up. Cool, now let's try Command F. Cool, now I see the search bar on the top right-hand corner. Let's test this out by echoing something. Sammy, Rammy, Boo, Boo, Yay. Okay, so in our search bar, let's search for Boo. And we can see that Boo is highlighted. Cool. So another cool thing about this plugin is that we can customize it. So on the README, we can change the border radius or the button border radius or even the button margin. So let's just try to change one of these by copying the hyper search UI. Copy that. And then let's go back to our configuration file. So here, all we have to do is paste those lines in. Make sure you put the commas here and save. And let's maybe change the border radius to 20. Cool. Now we can see that the border radius has indeed changed.